Hi everyone, I'm Big Al with Country Music News International here at CRS, Nashville, Tennessee. And uh, this mover and shaker young lady over here has got some big things going on. We're going to talk about all of that and a brand new song called Funny Girl. Ray Lynn is with us and welcome to Country Music hey, News hey, International. Hey, thank you for having me. It's CRS week, baby. I know, and we're all busy. I can't believe it's already here. This is my... Okay, I started doing this at 18, so this is my 11th. CRS. <laughs> I think I've skipped a few, but most of them I've, I've always done something. But yes. well, it's always good to network a little it bit. Is, isn't it? it is. And I think everybody coming into town and you get to see a lot of familiar faces, I always love it. Yeah. Well, I'm glad to get a chance to meet you. Yes. And uh, before we get into the music, there's one thing I got to ask. Yeah. Out of all the awards and all the things that you've been doing, and I've seen also some of the crowds that you've been yeah. performing in front of, a billion streams. Yes. And I'm not very good in mathematics. I'm, I'm talking a billion, not a million, a billion. I think that is the most amazing Thank thing. You. What do you think about that? Um, it's something that I still qu can't quite comprehend. A billion uh, career streams is a lot. But, you know, it, it just goes back to the fans. You know, my the one thing I love about uh, music and, and streaming is... You never know when a song is going to relate to somebody again, and I'll I'll see a surge in a song that I released maybe eight or ten years ago mm -hmm. because of social media and all sure. kinds of things. But it's it feels really good, and I'm just I'm proud of my my fans and the fact that they've stuck along with me on this journey for over ten years. And um, you know all those shows that I've played some sometimes it's fifty people, a hundred people, or five thousand or more than that. And some of the festivals I've played, but Every show, every moment counts, and you can see that in that. I think it's worth mentioning uh, all the awards that you have uh, received from the Country Music Association. If you would, I, I'm not going to even try to start. I, I'm going to ask Ray Lynn to do that. So yeah. name us some of those uh, great awards that you've received. Yeah, so I've, I've been nominated for a couple times for ACM New Female, uh, which was super cool, and a few CMT awards. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, but one of the biggest awards that I've received that was really cool was my record went number one on the Billboard Country Chart, my debut record, and only a few females have done that. Uh, Shania Twain, Taylor Swift with her first record, uh, Wine on a Judd, so I feel like that's a really good company of people to do. And so, um, yeah, I was really proud of that. Let's talk about your social media. I know you're on social media everywhere. you got a website, correct? Yes, Raylin.com. Simple, Raylin.com. Very easy. RayLynn.com. Snag it real quick. So tell us about the uh, new song coming out. Yes, Funny Girl. So I uh, had the idea for this song, kind of speaking to my younger self, and you know, I think about the life that I've built, and I'm getting to do what I love, being an artist and a songwriter, and travel on the road. But more than that, I I have really great friends that have been in my life since I was a you know, 11, 12, and mm -hmm. I have an amazing husband. I have a beautiful daughter and a beautiful family. And I was just thinking about the life that I have. And I was just like, you know, it's, I wish I could tell that funny girl that grew up, you know, had fangs for teeth before she got braces <laughs> and was a little crazy. And, you know, that this is what her life was going to look like. Mm -hmm. And um, I, I think this song is really special because it just highlights you know, growing up and going through the growing pains of, you know, just being a young ad adolescent to, you know, becoming a woman. And I'm, I'm really excited to see where this song takes off. So uh, is the song out to radio right now? No, it goes out uh, March 15th. It goes, you know, we, we release right. it. So then we'll see what we're going to do So everybody, that. you'll be able to check out yes, all of that. Yes, March 15th. Mar yeah, that'll start March 15th, of course. Raylin.com, that's the best place to go. You'll see all the news, and I'm sure. And uh, some touring dates. What's going on with you on tour? Yes. Uh, I know you're going to be probably about all over the world because yeah. the fact is you already have been. So. Yes, so we we have a show, a couple shows in Texas coming up, and then we're just, honestly, I, I just signed with a new booking agent, and they're just doing so great with booking me in, like, really cool theaters, and we're doing some awesome festivals and stuff. But, yeah, wherever you can come see me, all my tour dates are on my website, and come on out. It's a fun, rowdy time. If I take a bus, I take my daughter, and uh, my whole fam family comes out, and it's just, it really is special. We make it a family affair. It's great. Um, 
I remember something. You just said something. I, I have talked with you, and it's been a year or so ago. Didn't you, uh, and I'm sorry, I'm just reminiscing a little bit here, but didn't you do a song in, in, with a camper in it, an old camper? Yes, I did. What's wrong with that? Not, yes. not a thing in the world. I just remember when you yeah. said uh, fan family, I said, yeah. that's the word you used, and we was talking about yes. your husband and daughter. Yes, yeah, so my yeah. a song that I released last year, so I released Broken One last year, and my husband and daughter were in the video. Yeah. And then I released a song called What's Wrong With That? That, uh, where I yes. had to bribe my husband to take a shirt off to mow in the music video. I mean, he does it. He always has a shirt off when he's mowing at home, but to get him to video it, that was a different thing. <laughs> um, but, yeah, he took a couple tequila shots and did it and did a great job. But, yeah, yeah. having him and my, my daughter in the video was so cute, and it's just great because those videos will live on forever. Yeah, folks, I just remember that when she said that word, so that's a great memory. So one more thing, and uh, we'll, we'll let you go. But, yeah. Uh, can you maybe give me just something that drops in your head, uh, a great memory? Because you have had already a, a really great yeah. country music career. What's, what's one of the greatest memories of your country music career so far? I know it's a little bit of a tough open-ended question. But. No, I would say one of my greatest memories was being at the ACMs with my daddy. Um, my husband, I don't know if you know this, but my husband... Uh, used to be in the military and so he was in the army branch and so my husband was gone training I hadn't seen him in like eight or nine weeks I was really missing him and my dad decided to be my plus one mm -hmm. at the ACMs and I was nominated for new female that year mm -hmm. and then right before me and my dad got to walk the red carpet together um, I found out that my debut record had went number one on the Billboard country chart and it still makes me emotional thinking about it because Mm -hmm. I was sad because I couldn't share that news with my husband, but I was also just so grateful. And my dad was there who has just sacrificed so much for me to be, you know, where I'm at today. And mm -hmm. I just thought it was such a special moment. It's a moment I'll never forget. I'm sure it's not. Yeah. You know, it's really great to meet you and get good a chance to, good to, to talk see with you. you. Yes. And I hope we can do this again yes, sometime. Yes, I would love that. Thank you. And don't forget, everybody, Funny Girl, you're going to be able to get it on any download. Check it out on radio and just about any place. Raylynn.com. Raylynn, thank you so much. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. You're very welcome. And for more country music news, all you have to do is go to countrymusicnewsinternational.com. I'm Big Alan Nashville.